Hey everybody, BrickLover18 here today with a video on a LEGO product that a lot of you probably have never seen, especially if you're a newer fan of LEGO. And that is the LEGO Loyalty Card. The LEGO Loyalty Card was actually LEGO's old VIP program. This VIP program literally just replaced the Loyalty Card program, making it just the VIP program. So the LEGO loyalty card is literally, it's the exact same size pretty much as a business card. And it's just the loyalty card. It's like an envelope. So all it is is up here, it says use your LEGO loyalty card every time you shop in the LEGO store to earn valuable rewards. You have your name there and it's copyright 2008. So you know it's a little old. And what it basically did is, is every time you spent $25, they gave you a stamp after you spent uh, $200, you got $10. After you spent $400, you got $20. And I actually just noticed as I was making this video that the stamps are little Lego figures. I honestly thought they were, because they had stamped them so weird, they just looked like little spiders to me and I never actually looked up close. Here on the back of the card is just the terms and conditions. There are actually a lot of them, so if you want to read them, pause the video. You're probably wondering, why is VOID written all across it? Well, actually, because when they replaced this loyalty program with the VIP program, I didn't know that, and I actually brought this card to the LEGO store to get my loyalty points, and they said that they had actually replaced the method, so they gave me the points I had received on here onto the VIP card, and they were just going to throw this out, but because it's such a cool thing, I asked if I could keep it, and they just wrote VOID on it. And as you can see, I had only spent $100 with this program because there's only four stamps. The advantage over the new LEGO VIP program over the LEGO loyalty card program was you could not use the loyalty card on LEGO Shop at Home. You can use the VIP card on LEGO Shop at Home. You couldn't use the loyalty card obviously because there's literally there's no number or anything saying whose accounts whose and it's just the stamp. So you could only use these on in LEGO stores. Another advantage to the VIP program was that you only got a stamp after every $25. So if you went in there and spent $24, they probably wouldn't have given you a stamp. But when you spend $24 on the VIP pro program, you get 24 points. With the VIP program, you also get to renew your or use your points a lot faster because you can use them every 100 points, so which is t equivalent to $100 and five dollars for lego but this one you had to use every 200 points 200 dollars and get the ten dollars so the like reward value hasn't changed you can just use them faster with the vip program and not have to wait so long for the loyalty program i personally think that the lego loyalty card looks quite a bit cooler than the vip maybe if they put the vip minifigure like here or something like that and had a card with the Lego logo in the yellow, I think it would look a lot cooler. It just, when honestly, one might look at this and not even know it's Lego, the VIP program, just because this one is quite Lego logo right on the front, the yellow colors, and it's just more identifiable as Lego. Identifiable as Legos. Thanks so much for watching this video of the Lego loyalty card. I find a lot of people here on YouTube are just newer LEGO fans or just sort of getting into LEGO. But if you have seen these LEGO loyalty cards, if you had one, just let me know down in the comments below because I'm kind of interested to know the people who have seen them before and the people who have never seen them before. Thank you so much for watching this BrickLover18 YouTube video. If you enjoyed this video, please give this video a thumbs up, comment on this video, as well as share the video with your friends. If you want to see more of my previously uploaded LEGO YouTube videos, check the cards as there's a playlist there featuring all the videos that I've uploaded so far. If you want to see more of my LEGO YouTube videos as I upload them, please click on the subscribe brick and you will subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want to check out more BrickLover18 and LEGO related awesomeness, please check out www.bricklover18.com where you'll find the links to my YouTube, my Instagram, my Twitter, as well as my BrickLink store. Thanks for watching this BrickLover18 video. Stay tuned for all things LEGO by clicking that subscribe button.